Okay, this is your Lover Widow Prince DJ again, and I wanted to come back. I had to make a part two for YouTube, which is probably going to be short. Now, I just did a rant about the uh, what happened at Arrowhead Stadium, the uh, the game uh, that was uh, was so crazy, and then the, even the crazier beginning. A cry was booed after the performance of Lift Every Voices thing because the fans didn't want them to replace with uh, the national anthem before the game. I mean, wow. Which is done in every Super Bowl, you know, like yeah, that said in 2020. I mean, this is this is really ridiculous. But I have heard it sung in different Super Bowls so far. I have heard it sung because I did watch the pregame and I watched the pregame on YouTube that time. Okay, but I'm going to sing, go ahead and sing the national anthem. Okay, here we go. And I'm not going to sing it too high because, you know, it's uh, crazy. But anyway. Oh, say can you see by the daughterly light what so proudly we hailed? As the twilight last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars do the perilous light on a vampire's feet watch, were so gallantly streaming, and the rockets red glare. The bumper sting in air came through through the night that our flag was still there. Oh, fate the fast stars spangled banner yet wave. Oh, the land. And of the free and the home of the brave. And I did two songs, even though I had to do two because I want both friends in the YouTube. But what's wrong with both songs? What's wrong with doing both songs during the NFL game? Heck, what's wrong with doing songs in all sports? You know? What's wrong with that? I mean, this is ridiculous. What is our country going into? Tell me. Tell me. Help me to understand. What is our country going into? Please. That was the saddest time that I have to read, even after a crazy loss. Unbelievable. And I haven't even done the week one aftermath of the NFL pickup yet. Crazy. Crazy. Just disappointed. So disappointed. Uh.